Knock knock. It's me. The Rat Boy Genius. I have been testing out my new starship. Rat Boy's kingdom is going on a voyage into space. Yay for me. While my ship is preparing for the journey, I have been investigating my first stop, the Red Planet Mars. NASA's Curiosity rover, also known as the Mars Science Laboratory, recently made some exciting discoveries in the Martian Valley. It might be the ruins of an ancient sculpture garden. I can see heads and body parts from numerous creatures strewn all around the area. Here are a couple of avian Martians, sitting and enjoying the scenery. It looks like an owl, talking with a dodo bird. This appears to be the head, from a statue, of a man. I wonder if the head is still connected to the statue, perhaps the rest of the statue is buried under the ground. There are many heads, from various creatures, scattered across the landscape. This one resembles a human skull. This one, looks like an orc, from Lord of the Rings. There is a creature with the body of a rodent, and the profile of a person's face. There appears to be another creature lying on its back in front of the rodent. Here we appear to have the head of a giant, seen in profile, and lying on top of the head is a piece from some sort of giant crustacean, with tentacles coming out of it. People might say, Rat Boy Genius, you have a wild imagination. You are looking at natural rock formations and imagining you are seeing heads and creatures. And I would reply, natural rock formations don't have cylindrical appendages like you see here. Green Monster suggested that this might be the scene of a horrible cataclysm, and what we are seeing are fossilized bones and skulls strewn about. He also suggested that many of these rocks resemble flattened pieces of shale, as if this might be a dried up river or lake bed. The summer solstice baby found what appears to be another head from a statue. It looks like a head broken off from a totem. The baby has really good eyes. She also pointed out two other statue heads. This one is lying on its back looking up and to the left. And this one is seen in profile looking up and to the left. Happy Man was impressed with this rock. He said it looks like a petrified tree trunk, and notice how smooth one side of it is, almost as if it were sliced with a power saw. There are many more interesting features in this panorama. I encourage you to examine the image for yourself, so you can make up your own mind about what Curiosity has found on Mars. The link to the original image is in the video description. Gotta go now. Bye.